Look, there what we go. have here, Andrew <laughs> Tate has launched Top G Comic, and it's going for $97. Now, I believe that's US. Now, I just want to remind you, this is the same Andrew Tate that said yep. reading is stupid and a waste of time. Uh, this is and the he's also same Andrew Tate that... Look, this was my response to him. You know crowdfunding is really popping off when a con man who trashes all forms of pop culture suddenly decides to launch his own comic. Hopefully his comic character has a page of him watching his wife be fucked by another dude so that way his fan base can feel represented. Because what he, I'm saying here is they're all Andrew that. Tate fans are cucks. He has mm -hmm. also shitted on nerds in the past. Yes. The thing is, well, yeah. Liking a comics and anime heroes and all of that sort of shit. Yeah. And now he comes out with this. Oh, yeah, and worse than that, he doesn't even doesn't even offer express shipping to Australia. So now I've got to wait three months for the book. <laughs> <laughs> do you reckon and he's noticed? Do you reckon he's noticed the success of like the Ripperverse or something? Like I saw one and two, and he's like, mm, maybe there's money here. I I don't oh, think he's noticed that specifically. I don't think he pays attention in that regard. But I just think he is, and I know this word is way godly overused, but he's just a grifter. Now. Let's uh, have a look he used at it, to work shall we? Yeah. Is this, so, right? is this a here. trailer for it? Sort he's of... even done a trailer for it. That's he's doing the, the he's doing the typical fucking. Th this is this is so hypocritical. Yeah, right here, from him. you know, crowdfunding is really popping no, off. Yeah, cr crowdfunding is, but like this is so hypocritical from him. Exactly what Mozzle was saying, mm -hmm. because and it's what we said at the beginning. He was giving nerds shit. Massive amounts of shit. Massive amounts of shit. Saying that these are the fucking, these are the, you know, half the problem, basically. They're not they're, men anymore. Yeah, like, they're, they're, I'm a nerd, yeah. but I know that I'm a man and I'm, you know, fucking. Okay, maybe, maybe not. But like, <laughs> but you know what I mean? Like, yeah. I'm fucking, a man. I own Lego. You say you don't have a dick. Yeah. Uh, question. <laughs> How did Andrew Tate even become like relevant or famous? So like, what he did, happen? what he did is his Most first scam. This one. Uh, yeah, so what, is, what is what his first scam was is he had this link, um, and if you shared that link, you got paid, right? So what happened was thousands of people were doing, um, getting clips from his podcast and having that link because as soon as someone clicked on that link, scam. you got five dollars, right? It pyramid scam, and then so TikTok just got fucking flooded. Literally, like video after yep. video would just be Andrew Tate fucking podcast and i didn't even know where the fuck to find the podcast i just knew it because it was just tiktok everywhere yeah everyone was doing it because you get you got money uh if someone clicked on that link even for once they didn't have to do anything out of the other than click on that link and then uh whoever shared that link got paid money so it was just this massive like money fucking thing it was wild like and i mean thousands so of where did this money come from people. him so he so uh how he is he already it. rich Sex trafficking it's because it's, so no, he, he does OnlyFans, so yeah, so he's a pimp. yeah, he pimps out women, yeah, so he oh. pimps out women, um, and they he um makes he also made money from fighting as well. I will say, I mean, that. They, like, he did make he, he did, did not make money any from money from fighting, he's admitted that he, he, he made he, money, he didn't, he didn't, but make, he he didn't make much from that, he didn't make yeah. a lot, but he made money from it. Not no, enough to pay people. See, for I know nothing about him really. I'm just like, yeah, he's a bald dude, okay, cool. He yeah he did he couldn't even pay his rent with the money he says. Um, yeah, no, he could because the, the problem is kickboxing doesn't pay. Kickboxing is kickboxing the lowest form of yeah. Yep. <laughs> Russell <laughs> Hall. I'm sorry, but Mazel already pre-ordered the comic. I, I think Blab's just dried off. Like I'm sorry, <laughs> that's kind of funny. Yeah. <laughs> what? I'm actually making a Mazel Whoa 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 whoa! What was that? What was that? I'm making a Mazel manga. It's gonna be hella lit. Uh, Kenzo doesn't even know, but he's been hired to draw it. I guess yeah. that, I guess that one's going to be called Bottom G. <laughs> but anyway, let's let's watch the ad, shall we? Let's not forget the impact Top G and Talisman are having around the world. Superheroes in every sense. This dude almost like bagging. Did you shit. have? You've had no impact other than retardation. <laughs> You're a meme. You're a meme. The art on the front cover is pretty fucking bad. It's awful. But anyway, <laughs> it kind of looks scary and um, oh, yeah. like, scary. it's not. It's not shit. like. No, it's look not. Um, it, the ratios are wrong. Look at his body yeah. compared to his neck compared to his head. Like it's just. Where's my boy his... Tristan? He's he's got right a go he's got a goiter on the back of his neck. <laughs> like him. Right there, mama. That doesn't fucking look like cringe, him, dude. If you're an Andrew Tate fan, you are a cuckold. Make no fucking mistake about it. Oh yeah. All right.
Oh yeah, like, you know, yeah, you're the you're the worst. Yeah. Oh, terrible. Look at Grant's frozen face when he did that. That was perfect. Ninety-seven dollars. That's was a it, terrible that, trailer. That is a terrible trailer. Was that was that Jeremy? Was that Jeremy's logo? Was that the D Day Cobra logo at the end with the different letters in it? Uh-huh. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know. DNG Comics, first yeah, limited yeah. edition. There were no real superheroes left until now. Join Top G and his battle against the Matrix. <laughs> What's D D G stand for? Like dope gamers or something? What's he going Fuck for? Knows. Remember, like, oh, when, remember when that new James said. Bond movie came out? He was um calling himself James Bond. Uh, <laughs> dogs oh, no game. An all time, an all time collectible. For who? Toilet his, paper. He's got to put. I his, look at my gotta, boy Tristan. He's got to put his Bugatti in there. Yeah, fucking no. That's the that's the main uh, character. <laughs> you you said it like John Travolta when you said that, my Bugatti. Oh, the attack against me is relentless. You really are a cuck if you like Andrew Tate. Uh, they don't want you to know the truth. They are. They want you living in a mental cage, chained by weak mindset. I became the superhero of the year. <laughs> and by telling the truth and teaching young men to be strong, and now I am being punished for it in real time. You're a hypocrite. Uh, these stories reflect the harsh truths of the Matrix how I escaped it, and then I predict, and what I predict they'll try next. You're talking about escaping the Matrix, fucking hell. You spend more time on Twitter than a teenage girl.